Hey guys, it's Arbstan. Today we walk to episode 2 of my Trading For You series. And if this video gets a 60 thumbs up by 6pm GMT, I will upload a double upload for you guys later on today. So if you didn't miss episode 1, I do recommend you guys go watch that. But basically what this series is about is I draw a number between 1 and 10 from a random generator. And that number is worth a certain value. For example, 3 is worth 15k. Then let's go and trade to that 15k. And when, once I have traded to it, I then give it away to one of you guys. I just want to say thank you for the support on the first episode. It was absolutely amazing. I've got over like 200 comments, which is just absolutely crazy for me. So here you guys see, I actually drew the number, and the number that came up was two, and that basically means I have to trade to 10k in this episode. So of course, remember guys, if you do want to have a chance to actually go and win the coin amount, just all you have to do is just comment, like comment anything, like good video, hello. You know, I've had some pretty random comments coming in, but anything you want to comment, just comment, and you're going to be in for a chance to win the actual coins. Any console guys, Xbox, PS, anything. I don't really care because I have got a PlayStation account of course, so don't worry about that. So you guys can see some of the uh, non-rare bronze cards are sold on and one of the rare cards have. And the bronze cards are so unpredictable. So if you get a good amount of 80 pace, 70 pace bronze cards, you're going to get a lot of coins to start off with. But if you don't, you're going to get a really low coin amount to start off with. And I think I've been quite, quite lucky so far, let's say. So you guys can see um, I've actually bought a few silvers. So, for example, we got this uh, Matthew Upson, former Arsenal player, of course. I went and bought for 400 coins, and I attempted to list them up for 900 coins. And as you guys can see, they all sold on, and also a few more bronze rare cards sold on, which is absolutely fantastic. Actually, all of them sold on eventually, which is fantastic. And uh, you can see 200 coins, some sold on for, a few for 150. And uh, here you guys see another one for 200 coins, a rare bronze card. Another one for 200 coins. Then my Dana sold on for 550 coins. And eventually the Chris Wood sold on for 500 coins and the Matthew Upson for 900 coins. So now we're moving on to gold rare, my gold rare converter method, which works so well. I've been using it today as well. It works really well and I do recommend if you are struggling to make coins to go and actually try that method. So the Montelievo sold on for 3.5k and here you guys can see I've got two Alex songs right here. One in the Catalyst and one in the Shadow. If you, if you guys are not aware of what my uh, gold converted method is, it's basically where I put gold and I search for the CDMs, the CMs and the CAMs with different chemistry styles. Because chemistry styles and position changes always put the price of the players up and uh, it's a great method to use. And I listed both the songs up and here you guys see one sold on for a nice cool 3.1k. That's the shadow one and the catalyst sold on once again for 3.1k as well. And here we have a converted Fernando Torres. That is very, very rare to find strikers who are converted to cam. So I knew straight away that that was a fantastic deal. And also we've got Christian Eriksen in his CM. He's normally a cam with a Hunter chem style on him, which I knew straight away, bang. Because there's not many Eriksons in the CM position, which is so it's a very rare deal to actually get. So Eriksen sold on for 4k. And uh, also the Fernando Torres, as you'll see in a moment, has also sold on for 4k, which is absolutely fantastic. So we're now really, really close to our target of 10k. And this is actually the last batch of deals to get us to that 10k. So we have Marek Hamjik, which we bought for 2.7k. And attempted to list up for 3.8k. And finally, we have a Shinji Kagawa, who I've actually went and bought for 2.4k. And attempted to list them up for 3.1k. And as you can see, they all sold on. Shinji Kagawa sold them for a nice cool 3.1k, which I, of course, listed them up for. Marek Hamjik for 3.8k. And finally, got Ramirez, who went and sold on for 3.2k. So, of course, we've now reached the 10k, which, of course, I now have to decide who I'm going to go give the coins away to. So, there was 190 comments in the last video, and the number that came up was 10. So, the 10th comment has actually won the 10k coin. So the next thing I do is I go and scroll down. Remember this is excluding any comments I personally made. So I scroll down and scroll down and the guy with the 10th comment is this guy right here, Minecraft Gaming. And so his comment was, I like your shoes, which is quite interesting. But you have now won the 10k. So please go and send me a private message with the card details and I'll be happy to go and send the 10k over to you. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed episode 2 on my trading few series. It'd be great if you can get behind this series. 100 thumbs up on this episode, that'd be great. And remember 60 thumbs up by 6pm GMT for a double upload. So yeah, drop a like, subscribe, so hop, start and I'll see you guys in the next video. Yep, see you guys.